Theresa May today vowed to overturn a key change to her Brexit legislation imposed by the House of Lords last night, which the Prime Minister claims could stop Britain leaving the EU. The Prime Minister said, when the proposed change comes back to a vote in the Commons, the government would be robust in trying to block it. But her spokesman could not give a clear answer on Tuesday as to whether government whips believe they have the support of enough MPs in the Commons to overturn the change. The Prime Minister's spokesman said, What the amendment which was passed last night would do, is weaken the UK's hand in our Brexit negotiations by giving Parliament unprecedented powers to instruct the government to do anything with regard to the negotiations including trying to keep the UK in the EU indefinitely. Downing Street would not commit to saying the Prime Minister was confident she would overturn all of the defeats in the Lords. A source said, We will look at the amendments, but the fundamental point is that the bill left the House of Commons in a way that could deliver a smooth Brexit, and that is how we want the bill to complete its course. What is important is that it keeps the government's hands open on negotiations with Brussels. Is Brexit going to happen? Question mark. Will Theresa May stop Brexit? Question mark. Theresa May, who has? Remained FIRMO and they are cleaving the U despite voting remain in the referendum, has previously said she will give Parliament a vote on the Brexit deal she agrees with the U.Rutus Brexit news. Theresa May vowed to carry out Brexit the bill left the House of Commons in a way that could deliver a smooth Brexit, and that is how we want the bill to complete its course. Downing Street spokesman, but the leading politician has warned that, if it is rejected, the UK will crash out of the block with no deal. Today, she issued a hardline response to peers in the House of Lords, after she was left with a fresh string of defeats over the EU withdrawal bill last night. The government suffered three more Brexit defeats in the House of Lords overnight, taking the total to nine so far. And the stinging rebuttal left Lion Fox accusing unelected peers of trying to block the UK from leaving the European Union. Speaking last night he said it would be rash for Labour MPs who represent Leave voting constituencies to back the Lord's amendments to the EU withdrawal bill, when it returns to the Commons. And he added, I think there is a very big debate now, about whether the unelected House can actually thwart the view of the British electorate in a referendum, and legislation coming from the House of Commons. Jetta Brexit News Theresa May vowed to overturn a key change to her Brexit legislation for Brexit News. The cabinet is made up of leading Brexiteers we don't have a parliamentary majority and that makes life harder, but there are of course quite a number of Labour MPs who represent seats. Where there is a very heavy vote in favour of leaving who I think are rash, to say the least, if they try to confront the democratic view of the British people. However, despite Mr Fox's fervid commitment to THEBREXIT cause, many still believe Brexit will not happen. In December, Pantheon macroeconomics Samuel Toombs said he was convinced Britain won't actually end up leaving the EU. He wrote, a transition deal which keeps the UK inside the single market and customs union, but gives it no say over its rules is the only viable outcome in 2019. Quote, the UK likely will go into a transition deal, intending it to last for only two years, but we see a high chance of it becoming permanent. Quote, the same month. A YouGov poll found 46% of people now think the UK was wrong to vote to leave, compared to just 42% who think the Brexit vote was the right thing to do.